ஓம் நமோ பகவதே ராமகிருஷ்ணாய ஃபஸ்டீக்கர்ஸ் ஆஃப் காட் ஸ்பிரிச்சுவல் டாக்ஸ் ஆஃப் மகாபுருஷ் சுவாமி சிவானந்தா கண்டினியூஷன் ஆஃப் சாப்டர் ஃபிஃப்டி எயிட் பேஜ் நம்பர் ஹண்ட்ரட் அண்ட் தேர்ட்டி செவன் எபிசோட் ஒன் ஒன் ஃபோர் த மொனாஸ்ட்ரி அட் வேலூர் ரிச் வித் மெனி ஹோலி அசோசியேஷன்ஸ் மகாபுருஷ் மகாராஜ் கண்டினியூஸ் இன் தோஸ் டேஸ் ஐ ஹேட் கிரேட் லாங்கிங் அண்ட் ரெஸ்ட்லெஸ்னஸ் டு ரியலைஸ் காட் while walking i would practice remembrance of god and pray to him earnestly i disliked the company of men and would avoid roads ordinarily frequented by travelers towards evening i would find shelter somewhere and spend the night absorbed in my own thoughts night is the ideal time for spiritual practice there being no external noise and bustle at night the mind naturally becomes quiet i wandered like this for a long time if one lives this way having no possessions one develops full resignation to god one becomes established in the idea that god alone is our protector in prosperity as well as adversity mahapurush ji now sat down on a chair and the conversation continued mahapurush mara said no the master has graciously kept me here for his service no the master has graciously kept me here for his service i don't feel like going anywhere now the guru and mother ganga are on two sides between them I am in great peace. This place, Belur Mat, is verily Vaikuntha, the heaven of Vishnu. The Lord of the universe himself is here for the good of the world. A perfect and soul like Swamiji lived here. How much spiritual rapture and ecstasy has been experienced here. of a master who is self contained is here and all his apostles live in this place in their subtle bodies and sometimes we see them mahapurush maharaj continues if a spiritual aspirant attains illumination in any place that place becomes holy and this belur mat is the holiest of holy places how sacred is the very dust of this place it will take a long time for humanity to know and realize what sri ramakrishna and swami ji were the world has not seen such spiritual giants manifested for the good of the world in thousands of years buddha came and after several hundred years people understood a little of him and his liberal message spread throughout the world just think what a furo was made over a tooth of buddha that had been carried somewhere what a big temple was built to commemorate that tooth and here we have the relics of sri ramakrishna the holy mother swami ji and the others when i think about these things my hair stands on end how many people will come from distant countries to worship the ground of the belur mat there is already an indication of that it is not at 50 years since the masters passing away and it what a spiritual revolution is taking place throughout the world because of his personality we are blessed that we can see these things you will see even greater things to be continued om shanti 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 hari om tat sat shri ram krishna arpanamastu